Hello YouTubers and welcome to me, it's Dave from both Geeky Bricks and Destination Vlogs. I'm not entirely sure which channel this is going to be on apart from Destination Vlogs at 100% be on there. Whether it makes it way, makes its way to Dest, sorry to Geeky Bricks is dependent on my subscribers and viewers on Geeky Bricks. So I put the question out to them, do you want to see the unboxing of this on that channel? So you may be watching it on Geeky Brits, but you'll be definitely watching it on Destination Vlog. So, you would have seen as part of a haul video um, that I bought the DJI Phantom 4 drone or quadcopter um, and a number of accessories as well. Some came with it as a package and others I bought separately for Amazon. So it's all turned up now, which is fantastic. So I want to do an unboxing to share with you, um, particularly with that, what comes inside the box for the DJI Phantom 4, but I'll also quickly show you some of the other bits that I bought, um, like I said, as part of the package and some a additional. So we'll start off with uh, the DJI 4 Phantom itself and get that unboxed just so you can see exactly what comes um, as a standard if you just buy the DJI Phantom 4 alone and not part of a package. So let's get on, let's get this unboxed, and then we'll have a quick look over the other bits that I bought as well. Okay, so here we go. Here is the actual box of the DJI Phantom 4. Very nice, very prof good professional finish on this, um, as we can see here. Just spinning it round there. So I'm going to find my trusted knife just to cut the seal, which is here. Yeah, it is sealed, which is a good sign. Okay, so there we go, that is the seal broken. Now, I've already seen um, a number of videos, YouTube videos on this, so I know how this comes because this is really impressive actually, what DG, DJI have done um, as part of the Phantom 4, which is, if we get the what's inside the box out, you can see there, there is a handle and some very tough polystyrene type material in there. There goes the box. Okay, so this is what it looks like inside. Um, there is a logo there. See if we can try and pick that up, but it does say, there we go, get it in that shot, DJI Phantom. Yeah, just DJI Phantom. So anyway, um, that's what it looks like. Like I said, it is a um, basically a storage box for it, stroke a transportation case for the um, Phantom 4 which is awesome you know to come with that so I've got a backpack as you saw wouldn't really need it because I can just take it around like this very sturdy it's protected in there so how you get into this it's got its own clasp there I have seen some people on YouTube just doing that and then going oh it did work on one now like that and going, I can't get into it one open one open one open I'm trying to prise it open but I mean, it does actually show on there actually if you have to look on there uh, there is a little uh, lock with a little arrow, um, so you do simply just twist that like so, and then it opens up. Um, and it is hinged, so I'm just going to tilt this forward and pray that it doesn't fall out, so you can actually get to see the Phantom 4, and now it's all packaged up in there. So let's get this out, piece by piece, just put that over there. So the first thing I'm going to get out is the actual drone itself. Oh, now that does look pretty awesome. Oh, and then you drop the battery there. So it has the battery um, just pushed in there, as you can see, it goes in there. In fact, we take that out. So there's one of the pieces that comes with it is the battery. We obviously have the Phantom 4 itself, and then the motors, and spin it around. There you get to see the camera stroke gimbal. It's got a gimbal, um, a uh, little holder in there to secure it in place uh, while it's being transported stroke not used. So that's the Phantom 4 itself. What else have we got in here? We've got uh, DJI Care. So this is going to be user guide. You have control. Uh, be safe, be legal. So there's some information in there. Um, and obviously Phantom 4. So that's going to be various documentation instructions I'd imagine. Right, next thing, if we go over to the side here, this is where our actual blades are, um, obviously for the motors. Kind of a nice little carry bag there, as you can see. So if I was to take one of those out, you actually get to see the rotor blade there, one of the rotor blades. Uh, 
I think there's eight. I'm sure this comes with eight. So we have spares. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It does indeed. Um, one thing to point out when I'm unboxing it, they come with two separate coloured rings on it. One is black, which you can see there. And one is silver. Now they line up with, very important, the different colours um, against the motors. So if we can see that down on there is a silver one and over on here is a black one. So black goes with black, silver goes with silver. And quite obvious. So eight of the actual blades and the little carry case. We have then got the charger. So the actual power pack um, itself, it comes with two end connectors. Uh, one to charge the battery, which I believe is that one. Um, and this is a bit like the Apple um, charger, so you can put this in either way, that way or that way. Um, and it's also got another end on it, which is that connector there, and that is for charging the uh, control unit. So that's the power pack. Okay, there we go. Over here we have some more cables. Uh, we have a, looks like a mini USB um, to a USB adapter. Trying to get some focus on that, which you can see there. And we have a, again, I think that's a mini USB, it could be micro USB. It's a micro USB to a USB. Um, that's gonna be for, I believe that's for actually, if you've got an Android device, that's for connecting up your either tablet or Android phone. Um, using that cable, it doesn't come with an Apple one, so you have to use your Apple cable for connecting up. We then have, in fact, some out in here, let's get that out of the way. There's more. We have got the power plug, um, which is in there. It's in this bag. I'll get that out. Let's get it out now. It's all got to be unboxed. So we have our standard power adapter. Uh, three pin plug because I'm here in the UK um, to a kettle type um, connector at that end that obviously goes into the power pack and then I think finally this should be finally is the actual control unit itself um, which we can see there so we have our antennas there um, which can obviously be moved around for storage here we have the actual dock for putting in either your phone or your tablet. So you can see that it just fits in there. This part here adjusts. I'm going to work out how to do that. Oh, how down with tape, I remember that. So pull that tape back. And that should. Yeah, you can see it there. That now adjusts up and down. So you can hold your tablet in, etc. So there's the actual controller unit. So let's just pause this video, get this tidied up, and we will be right back. Okay, so there we get to see all laid out what comes as part of the actual package if you buy just the drone um, itself. Like I said, I got a number of other accessories, so uh, let's take a look at those um, now. So, um, as part of the package, so this is actually part of the package. I paid, I uh, can't remember how much, much more I paid for it, but um, it's kind of a package deal, really. So, I got a lanyard that's obviously for clipping on to the actual controller. Um, and then obviously that can be hung around the neck, your neck rather. So we've got a seven piece filter kit for DJI. It says Phantom 3 series, but it will fit the Phantom 4 as well. It's certainly better do. So just getting that out of the box as well. Let's just put that to one side. Got some other pieces in here. So this is all new as I'm opening this. Doesn't quite work what that is. I think that's the covers. Looks like a little cover protector. Um, another nice little bag actually. So we get a bag there, uh, which just opens up and then we can actually see the filters in there. There's one, two, three different filters and a cleaning cost. That's pretty cool actually. That comes in a nice little uh, package to keep those safe as well. So that is the filters. Um, we also got um, an additional battery, um, which is in here. So. Let's try, 
It says try it. There's the seal. Where's my knife gone? Let's just cut. Again, he says, yeah, let's cut the seal. You can see how they come as well, actually. So, again, very well packaged in this polystyrene protection. And you can see it in there, the battery. Let's just push that out. Okay, so there we get to see the additional battery, um, which I got. So, that makes obviously two batteries, which is going to be uh, good for getting some good flying time in there. And what else did we get as part of the package? We got this cleaning cloth. And we also got a 32 gig um, memory card. I'm going to keep that in the package because I'm not intending to use that one um, just yet. And it should have come with. Ah, no, that's why. Sorry. Um, it's been upgraded. Normally comes with a 16 gig. They upgraded to a 32 gig. So I don't get the 16 and the 32. Um, I just simply get the 32, which is fine. Um, because then what I also did was I bought some separate things. Um, from Amazon and one of those things was this a 64 gigabyte memory card you all know what a memory card looks like so again I'm not gonna get that out of the package um, what I also got from Amazon I think this is something you need when you're out flying particularly if it's uh, sunny is this sun shield or screen okay so this fits around Take that out, a bit of packaging. Obviously, I'm going to need to work this out when I get it set up. Looks like it goes. I think that folds down. So, ah, there we go. Folds down like that. Okay, so we end up with, and that's where your device would sit inside there. There are some suction pads to hold it in place. But you could imagine um, that on the controller. So, the controller is going to sit in there somehow. I don't know entirely know how until I uh, actually get it done. But basically that will hopefully block out the sun so that it doesn't obviously obscure what we are seeing on the actual screen of the tablet or phone or whatever it is you may be using. So the final thing, and again, this was part of the package deal, um, is this Manfrotto backpack. So let's get this out. Okay, because this looks like, it certainly looked like when I was looking at it on the website that I bought this from. Um, a pretty cool backpack because this is designed for phantoms. So let's just try and get into this. Leave it away just so you can see it because hopefully you'll see as soon as I open this up. He says, if we can actually work out how to get into it. Uh, is it that one? No, it's not that one. That's the top compartment. Sorry guys, you have to bear with me. Um, sorry, because I do really want to show you what this looks like inside. If we can ever get into it. Okay, that's the rear. Wow, this is quite complicated to get into. Let me just pause this video um, and then I will be back. He says, I can't find my controller. Okay, so I finally uh, worked out how to get into this backpack. There's a lot of compartments on this. It does look like a pretty awesome backpack. So uh, you open it from the bottom up. Um, there's some protection in there. So let's take that. Out. So, I mean, there's various pieces of bits in here, which I'm gonna have to try and work out. But basically the drone itself um, fits inside here. And um, again, like I said, I just need to work out how that actually works, but it fits in there. <laughs> Um, quite nicely and um, there is also a way that we can fit it on top here and again I'm gonna have to work that out with the rotor blades off when it's in there the rotor blades have to be off there's other compartments in there for batteries etc etc um, but we can also have it on the front of here with the rotor blades on um, but basically that is it guys for everything as part of this unboxing okay so there we go there is my unboxing stroke opening up of my dji phantom 4 drone and all the accessories as you can see laid out around here everywhere um, but hopefully that's given you a good insight as to what you get as a standard package and some of the accessories that you can get there's going to be loads more accessories i'm sure <laughs> Um, but I wanted to get the the basics, etc., um, to get me up in the air, get me flying. Um, so like the sunscreen, in fact, was quite important. Anyway, guys, hopefully you found this informative and you did like this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Let me know what you think of the DJI Phantom Floor. Hopefully, 
I'll be getting some filming done with the camera on the gimbal down here. Um, very, very soon are getting those uploaded to my Destination Vlogs channel and possibly Geeky Bricks, depending on what my subscribers want to see on that channel. So, like I said, give it a big thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to the, these, this, this channel, whatever one it may be on. Whether it's Geeky Bricks, Geeky Bricks or Destination Vlogs, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. That just leaves me to say, I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. See you soon. Bye, everyone. Bye.